Thank you for choosing the Moppet, the easiest and most effective way to clean your floor. This training video will train you on Moppet use, Moppet features, and simple Moppet maintenance. In one pass, the Moppet puts water on the floor, scrubs the floor, and picks up the water, leaving the floor dry. To use the Moppet, simply turn on the three switches and walk. You can walk at your normal pace. The Moppet keeps the dirty and clean water in separate tanks, so unlike a mop, you are always cleaning with clean water. To fill your Moppet fresh water tank, fill the green measuring cup with Moppet cleaning solution, pour the cleaning solution into the fill screen in the front of the machine, then with the hose fill the fresh water tank with water to the top of the fill screen. The Moppet is now ready to use. The Moppet has three switches, the vacuum switch, the water switch, and the brush switch. Simply turn on the switches and walk. The right side of the machine has an overhang so the brush can reach under shelving. After using the Moppet, you will need to drain the dirty water. To move the Moppet to a floor drain, tip the Moppet onto its transport wheels and then push the machine. Pull the drain hose out of its keeper, remove the drain hose cap, and place the hose in a floor drain. Whenever you're not using the Moppet, make sure to plug it in. The battery charger is automatic, so it will shut off when the batteries are charged. Leaving the Moppet plugged in for an extended period of time will not damage the machine. The charger light is red when charging and green when fully charged. The Moppet is equipped with a fresh water level gauge. On the right side of the Moppet you will find a squeegee lift handle. You can lift the squeegee to double scrub the floor. Double scrubbing allows the cleaning solution to stay on the floor while scrubbing heavily soiled areas. After double scrubbing, drop the squeegee back down and pick up the water on the floor. The Moppet has a manual water valve. This valve controls how much water goes into the drip tray and onto the floor. When the valve handle is horizontal, it is on and off when vertical. Moppet maintenance is very simple. We will go over changing the squeegee blade, cleaning the drip tray holes, cleaning the dirty water tank, and cleaning the water filter. Squeegee blades will need to be changed when the Moppet starts to leave water streaks and is not cleaning well. Each squeegee kit comes with new squeegee wheels and instructions. Remove the cotter pin. Slide out the clevis pin. Remove the vacuum hose. Remove the two wing nuts. Remove the two squeegee inserts. Remove the squeegee blade. Replace the squeegee blade. Make sure the notches in the blade are closest to the front of the assembly and closest to the Moppet brush. Replace the two squeegee inserts. Replace the two wing nuts. Place the vacuum hose and place the squeegee yoke over the squeegee pivot, pivot bracket, lining up the holes for the clevis pin. Slide in the clevis pin. Replace the cotter pin. And you're ready to go. Sometimes hard water scale or other debris can clog the drip holes in the drip tray. If these holes get clogged, you won't get water onto the floor and cleaning will be poor. You can also receive a, a static shock if water is not getting onto the floor. To clean the holes, unfold a paper clip and poke it through the hole in the plastic drip tray cover and metal drip tray. The Moppet dirty water tank will need to be cleaned regularly. When the tank gets dirty, the machine will start to smell bad when you turn on the vacuum. 
To prevent this smell, always drain the dirty water tank after use and clean out the dirty water tank often. After cleaning, you may also spray some bleach in the tank to get rid of foul odors. Hard water scale and other debris can clog the clean water filter. If you're not getting enough water into the drip tray and onto the floor, clean this filter. Before cleaning the water filter, turn off the manual water valve and tip the moppet on its back. Remove the filter housing from the silicone tube. Untwist the filter housing. Remove the water filter and rinse it under running water in a tap. Replace the filter in its housing. Screw back on the housing top and reinsert it into the silicone tubing. If your company is leasing the Moppet, all cleaning solution and Moppet parts are included in your lease. To order supplies and service, call Spectrum. Our phone number is right on the dashboard. Spectrum's priority is to keep your Moppet working like new. If you call during our 9 to 5 Mountain Time business hours, you will always talk with a live technician. After hours, you may leave a message and we will return your call on the next business day. If you have any further Moppet training questions, give Spectrum a call. one 800 290 2833